Welcome guys, it is a lovely 22 degrees here today on Monday the 31st of May and I can now finally record uh, I've been gone for 10 days I've had COVID-19 and my isolation period is over and I can now talk again I didn't want to do videos whilst I've done it because I like to sound like someone who smoked 5,000 cigarettes a day but you can see by the screen today, we're going to be doing a career mode on FIFA 21 and these videos will be about 45 minutes on each, 45 minutes each because I really want to get through these episodes and also just, for those episodes I like just only do the summer transfers and not do the first game of the season, I don't want to be like that, so anyways, the team I'm going to choose is the team that I support which is Manchester United. Uh, I'm going to play professional, put it down to, I'll oh, give it a fly, fuck off, sorry about that, that's fucking fly, alright, uh, transfer door on, transfer offers on, no takeover, uh, yeah, let's get to it. By the way, if you hear this, that's my fan, because it's really fucking warm today, so I apologise for that. Alright, and we are now here. July 1st, 2020, yep, as we see here, we've gotten me, right there, Picture when we get brighter. Okay. So let's have a look at the squad and we'll see where we can improve. Okay. Definitely put Pogba in. I think we keep the back line as it is. Thunderbike needs to play. Oh yeah, Bruno obviously has to play. Uh, let's see. Obviously, we need another centre back and a right mid. So let's get them sorted out, shall we? So the first centre back we're going to go for is Deo Upamecano. But if we can't get him, then I'm thinking of getting, let's see, probably Ruben Diaz, but I don't want to mess that up, but the first bit of business we're going to be doing is signing Jaden Sancho, obviously he's heavily linked with my United in real life, uh, in real life we could get him for under 100 mil so that's going to be a bargain so let's go with his current value hundred and eighty mil, fuck off I'll give you 125 55. How about that for you, yeah. huh? Alright, how about this? I ain't moving from there. So we take it or leave it. Seriously, you're gonna take some time to think about it. Well, if we don't get Jadon Sancho, I do know another person that we can get. Alright, so here are my alternatives from Jadon Sancho and Dale Meccano, which is Herbie Lozano, fair enough, and Milan Skrinar. 
That's when I obviously had a bit more oomph to him, more better defending, uh, more strength. He's just an overall better, but and also he's a team player. So that could be a good one. But aside from that, we'll advance to the 10th of July and we'll see you then. So here we are on the 10th of July. We have six messages. The open cards were scouted. Fuck's sake. Alright, anyways. We have two offers. Juan Mata to Wolves. We'll take that. Uh, I'm not selling Dean Hendo. He's only got, he'll only go out on loan. Sorry about that. Chair's very squeaky. It's an old chair. Alright, so Dale Meccano, 21 years old, 81 rated. Worth 48 and a half million pounds. Would that be what I want? Who knows? Alright, let's see. Oh, he's already gone to buy it. And he's on a rotation, so. Looks like we'll be going in for Milan Scrinar. So potentially our first sign up window, we're meeting up with Antonio Conte, former Chelsea manager. So squeaky, I'll be getting some stuff for it soon. So let's give him an offer of 70 mil to start off with. Fucking hell. I, I ain't giving him that much. You could have eight more. I don't care if it's non negotiable, I'll make it negotiable. Eighty two mil. Eighty mil. You need a little bit of time. I can go in for Dale Mercado, but he's gonna be like more expensive now he's joined a new club. So instead of being like seventy mil, it's gonna be ninety mil. Obviously, then we need to sort out this team. Um, we'll keep it like this for now. I'm going to trust Cavani to be the top striker for the season, but. We need to loan out some people, so let's get this started, shall we? He can bug off. He's retiring, so. Loan him. Um, he can go on as well. Brandon Williams. Oh, Alex, Alex Tellez? Yo, know, let's get Luke Shaw out on loan, even though he has been impressive this season. Don't need him right now. Same with you, Ek Baye. Phil Jones, I've never liked him, so he can go now. Alex Axel Twanzebe can go. Diogo Dalot. Yeah. Scott McTominay can get on the long list. Fred as well. Juan Mata can go. Galbraith, loan. Yolanda, loan. Rashford staying, contract by 12 months. There you go. And out on loan with you. Got to expire in 12 months. There you go. You can go to Wolves. On the loan list. I might leave Chester Lingard at. Fee. I'm at Diallo. No way. Loan. Short tire loan. Daniel James can be yeah, loan. Uh Wigmar Minor can go. Martial. What Martial? Um I'm gonna be flip flopping him with uh Yeah, get the year extension. Flip flopping him with Edison Cavani, but I don't know. 
Yeah, we'll sort out the uh, Anthony, Ars An Anthony Marshall situation soon. <sighs> Skip. Don't need it. Uh, we've got some important news. Six people want to chat to me. Well, I'm sad they're all happy to leave. Well, at the same time, it makes it easier, so. I know training improves their sharpness, I just don't want to do it right now, because we don't need them to be sharp right now. 104 million. You know what? I'll put, I'll put it up to 90 mil, see if they accept. Alright, let's go Ponte. Night email. Fine, we'll take it. We've gone down from 111 to 93. I'll take that. Alright, let's get these bastards in. Scrinar, crucial. I'm worried on who's going to have to do the wage. Uh, we'll do four years. And then we can, at 29, we could do three more. When he's 32, we could probably get him off. Nice, I don't need to do the wages. But let's remove the bonus, because he's going to be appearing in every game. <sighs> yep, alright. Our first signing of the window, Milan Sklena. Him and Harry Kane are going to be some fucking monsters in the defence. Let's get him in, shall we? Alright, so, is there a Bailly being the backup? It's going to be Victor Lindelöf. Alright, so Teller's going to come in because Shaw's going to go out alone for a bit. Marshall can start the games, Cavani can corner half time. I don't want to neglect time for them, but. We need to use both. So, we're going to go after the... Let's see, we've got 70 mil, okay. Jack Grealish. Play him up right, maybe? I don't know. The thing is, I would sign Jack Grealish, but we've already got Rashford. And I would play Big Campbell, we've already got Bruno Fernandes. There's your problem. We've already got in these positions people who are better, so I don't think we'll be able to sign Jack Grealish and keep him happy there because he won't be able to play every game. Dale Carno, don't need him anymore. Uh, still looking for right mid. Emil Smith Rose doing good. Uh, Conrad de la Fuente. No. How are you bold at 19? How? You can't be bold at 19, surely. Probably well, defending ground that was, but. Starts the point. It's Marley Sar. We could look at him, maybe. Irving Lozano won't join, but he's too important, apparently. That's been important. Oh, now they'll accept an offer. So, I'm thinking here, I want to convert Mason Greenwood into a striker. So then when I sell Marshall, and Cavani's going to start deteriorating, we can have Greenwood up and centre, taking that opportunity. But, so I'm looking to do his pace. Great, he's also four star, three star. Five star, three star. Alright, so this is how Jada Sancho will join the club. Let's go for Herving Lozano. Alright, so here we go. Uh, let's offer 40 million first off.
you don't have Luke Shaw. The only way you'll have Luke Shaw is alone. Alright, 50 mil, okay. Let's get down to 43 mil. See if they'll take it there. <laughs> yeah. You may be unnegotiable, but so am I. What, 18 mil? Cheaper. Alright, how about this? 44 mil. See, told you. I always get what I want. <laughs> and I've got your best right wing. You can also play left wing, so. Touche. Alright, he's gonna be. I'd say important because I still want to play green one a bit. Until he goes out alone. Uh, we'll do four years and then we'll do uh, later on. But I think in the next couple of seasons we will have to start worrying about. Ah, uh, fuck. Alright, 60k. Let's see if they'll take that. Uh. Yes! Herving Lozano, welcome to Manchester United. Alright, put that there. There we go. Alright, let's... Go six. I'll try to get my dog. It looks like one, two. There they are. There we go. One, two, three, four. There we go. Add some one more. You all said that. Alright. Now I'm going to start trading players up with sharpness, but I'm going to barely do the youth players, so I'll be back with you shortly. Alright, so the first drill <coughs> is going to be penalty kicks against the goalkeeper. We'll do Cavani, Greenwood, and let's see, where's Diallo? There he is. Alright. Let's play this drill. We'll do that in a minute. Let's change the next drill, shall we? So these are all drills that I'm doing. So it's going to be penalty kicks against goalkeeper. Cavani, Greenwood and Diallo. Path to goal, we're going to have Rashford, Pogba, Fred, Luke Shaw and Daniel James. And then we're going to do rookie attacking scenarios with Bruno Fernandes and Anthony Martial to build up their connection at the front. So I'll meet you when I've done the drills. Alright. <clears throat> so this is the best I could do for all of them. Uh, B on the penalty kicks, A on path to goal, and A on rookie attacking scenarios. They'll be the main ones I'll be uh, building up, so yeah. Any other business I want to do? Probably. So Herbert Lozano, obviously. Uh, got him at Milan's Granar. Uh, let's have a look at some transfer news. I might have a scout. Obviously. Dimitri Payet to Manchester City. No idea who that is. Uh, obviously, Herbie Lozano. Right. So, if there's any more interruptions, I'll see you at the start of the season. Alright, so we have some offers here. Um, Porto wants Scott McTominay for two years. Yep. Long to buy. 
No. A chance for offer for Victor Lindelöf. And one for Luke Shaw. I think I'd get a little bit more out of these guys. Maybe 30 mil. 32. Thirty-two mil. Oh, you think I'm joking? Thirty-two mil, pal. Pay up. There we go. And of course, Chris Man City reject. It is what it is. Liverpool and Piemonte Calcio trying to get. Must two next stars, okay. Alright, so it's Mali Sar, okay. 78 rated. Gabriel Martinelli, no, I'm not getting him. I made that mistake on my over career mode, so I do offline. But now there should not be any interruptions, and we'll get to the first game of the season. Alright, so the 6th of August, and uh, oh, five messages. Phil Jones, two year loan offer. Yeah. Cavani. You know what? Oh, that's got an idea. If I, I'm going to sell Cavani, I'm going to keep Martial as the second striker. But. I'm going to buy Robert Lewandowski. Sorry, I said, I said 30 mil. You look to the right there. So, Robert Lewandowski will be my next sign in. Okay, yeah, promote. Get rid. Yeah, I might as well. He can be a backup one. Release. Alright, so. Let's see how much this beast is going to cost. There is Robert Lewandowski. How much is it going to cost? Nearly 200 mil. Right. Okay. Okay. Let's see what's going to happen next. How about Harry Kane? Yes. I'm being serious. Okay. 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 About 150 mil for Harry Kane. I do want a new striker because I don't trust Martial to perform week in and week out. Carmack Lewin could be someone we could look at, but I don't think he's good enough right now. Olivier Giroud. I would have got Timo Werner, but he's just not performing right now, so I don't know if he's in good form or not. The Charleston could be someone looks like one of our mates. Uh Hulkin Billy Sharp. Billy Sharp, what do you mean? Alright, so let's see. Venetius, no. Jamie Vardy. No. Ollie Watkins, no. Danny Welbeck, former United player. Team of Werner. You know what? I'm actually thinking about it. Because he's actually in the realms. But at the same time, yeah. Alright, Timo Werner. We're going to sign Timo Werner. And this is my hands, by the way. I'm not actually shooting myself. Alright. 
Let's see. Let's start off at 60 mil. No. I need some money. I don't care. Little like I give it to us. Fine. Seventy. There we go. Alright. Timo Werner could be coming to Man United as the main striker. Alright, let's get in touch, shall we? Crucial, obviously. Obviously it's having a shit season right now, but I'm hoping to turn it around at United. A release clause, I want one sixty mil. 133. Okay. How about 145? Thank God they gave the offer. Um, we'll put this up to one mil, though. Okay. And we have got the main man, Timo Verder. Hopefully, he's good this season with United, because if he ain't, he's going out the door. I want 15 plus goals from this man. So, Cavani's not going to be here any longer. Soon, anyways. So, Timo Werner going up front. And I think that's a team that could win Prem this season. We'll play two games, first two games, and then we'll call it a day. But, I think that is what you call a successful transfer window. Let's see what the fans are saying about Timo Werner, shall we? I can't believe that footballers get paid so much a week. Messi gets paid half a million a week. He gets paid twenty-four million pounds a year nearly. That's just his wages. Not not merchandise, none of that. Golem then, might as well. Catholic or no. Alright, I'm gonna give these fans a good show today, so Let's get into the press conference. Thanks for joining us. We're now ready for questions. All right. Are you ready for your first game? Interesting. This is a strong squad. I've already found out a lot about this group of players. There's quality in the squad, that's for sure. Why have let me finish my fucking sentence? All right. If you want to look at this club and think about its traditions, if you think about where we want to be in the future, a qualified Champions League is absolutely essential. Look, Skuna is gonna is a big player and needs time to sell. Alright, so who's already played? Crystal Palace and Southampton and they drew. Okay. Man City have played to Everton, Liverpool facing Chef U, Leicester, West Ham, Tottenham, Fulham, Chelsea, Leeds. And then our next game is Burnley. And then Newcastle. And then Liverpool. Episode 2. I 
think we're ready. Against Brighton. They don't have a great attack, but they have a really good defence. Where's Dunk in their team? Who knows? But let's get into the first game of the season. Alright, so. First game. The first game we have this season is at the Brighton Stadium which is called the Amex Stadium Brighton Manchester United we have spent some bare peas fam if you're wondering we'll be playing every Premier League game this season I don't know if United win Champions League or Europa League we'll find out soon but This is it, ladies and gentlemen. The first game of the season. Milan Skrinar, new signing. Alex Tellez, Juan Bissaka. Okay, Lumpty, Burn, Ben White, Beltman, March. Alana, Bissoma, McAllister, Andoni, and Neil Malpe. So let's get right into this game, shall we, ladies and gentlemen? Um, obviously, as a team like Man United, we're hoping for a win against Brighton, but we can never underestimate our opponents. So especially against a team like ours, they will bring everything to the front to the front lines. So let's hope <coughs> for a win today, shall we, ladies and gentlemen. And it looks like it'll be Neil Malpe to kick off the first game of the season. Let's get right into it. I'm not going to be, be bothered to cut any of the game. I want you to see my genuine mistakes. And then you can tell me how to improve in the comments below. But before I continue, oh, Fernandez, Lozano, Van der Beek, oh. Fernandez, Pogba, Pogba to Werner. Werner shoots and it's the first goal. Timo Werner showing me why I spent about 70 million on him. What a goal by Timo Werner. Pogba with the beautiful assist. Assist. Werner brings it down and just whacks it into the goal. But Werner already proven its worth at the club. But as I was saying, ladies and gentlemen, please make sure to like and subscribe to the video. And a lot of effort has gone into this, and I I would appreciate it massively. I don't know if I'm going to upload it on my first channel or my well, my main or my second channel yet, but we'll see. Oh, Adam Alana puts it over to Labte. Obviously, a right wing back. So, we're used to seeing the right wing backs push up. Alright, Pogba now to Bruno Fernandes. And by the way, I'm not using any custom tactics. I can't be bothered with him. Oh, Timo Werner. Oh, Herbie Lozano's through. The pace. Crossing it in. Oh, Sanchez catches it. Obviously, I am going to be making Rush for the strikers. Oh, I did want to make Rashford a striker when um, Cavani retired or left. But it was either Lewandowski, Kane or Werner. Oh, we got one at three. Unfortunately, we were just shy of getting the money for Kane or Lewandowski. But call for Timo Werner can prove his worth to this club. Oh, Lazard, a beautiful pass to Hernan. Fernandez, Pogba, oh he loses the ball to Ben White and now Andone on the attack Maguire beautifully. We have 
two massive bricks at the back of the field. Harry Maguire and Milan Skriniar. Oh, and Maguire just let Adoni through there, but good job to Alex Tenez, I think it was. All right, Pogba to Rashford. Rashford still has the ball. Running outside, he has options in the area. Will he take the options though? Pogba, oh, just deflects off Ben White and Basuma. Gets it up the field to McAllister. Now Neil Malpe. If I'm being honest, I'm going for, I'm going for the league title this season. I'm going to, I don't know how many seasons I'm going to do, but I'm going for the league title this season, so let's hope so. Oh, Rashford turns the midfielder. Timo Werner has an open space there, but Lozano, oh, just saved by Sanchez. Lamptey takes the ball and whacks it upfield. Nearly half an hour into the game, Malpe has the ball, passes it back to McAllister. Masuma passes it, but Bissaka intercepts. Lozano, beautiful pass to Werner. Werner sees that. Oh, Rashford did make the run there. That was a poor mistake by them too. Liverpool score, Joe Gomez. Half an hour in. Oh. Alex Teller takes the ball off Lalana. Rashford was going to make a run there, but stops. Pogba to Van de Beek to Timo Werner. Werner gets. Oh! Gets clobbered by Ben White, who's been doing an excellent job in the back. Oh, Adam Lana chips over to Malpe. Now to McAllister. Oh, Harry Maguire just robs the ball. Now Herbie Lozano again just dashing it up the field. The number 15 crosses it in to Popper. To Rashford. Rashford misses. Just by the skin of his teeth there. Not that was actually pretty far. Brilliant play by my United so far in the first half. Oh, Bird and Fernandez collided there. Oh, to Malpe. Beautifully by Alex Telles. Herbert Lozano to Thibaut Werner. Werner. Chips over to Bruno Fernandes. Bruno! Oh, beautiful save by the Brighton goalkeeper. Now it's a corner. I'm not very good at these, but we'll see how it goes. See Harry Maguire in the box there. Oh, tried to go for it. Emi Lozano finds Pogba. Pogba! About to unleash there. Rashford! And it's offside for Marcus Rashford. But beautiful ball, a beautiful play right now by the Manchester United squad. Boots it down, Andone keeps it down there. Pass it to McAllister, one minute extra time. Will there be another chance? Maybe. Werner gets past the defender to Bruno Fernandes. Bruno! Bruno just misses his opportunity. I think it's offside anyways. Yep, offside by Bruno Fernandes. Would have been a lovely goal though, still. Oh, Pogba. And it's half time. Still a beautiful goal and we'll get to the second half shortly. So here we go, second half underway. Sorry that settings. To Pogba. Bruno, Van der Beek, Harry Lozano, just making some good runs so far this game, to Werner, Werner from outside the box nearly, Ben White doing another good job there, to team of Werner, Werner, I need to stop shooting from outside the box, oh Maguire intercepts McAllister, oh 
Wambasaka with a beautiful tackle. Oh, Lautaro Martinez to Real Madrid. Oh, free kick. Free kick to Manchester United. A Bruno Fernandes in a dangerous position here. 31 yards out. Let's see if he can do it. Very top corner. And that was a bad miss. And it's a corner, I guess. Yeah. Oh, the keeper came out there. Lozano just running after the ball to make sure Brighton do not get possession of the ball now. Pogba. Pogba! Deflected off Ben White's foot again. Oh, the last grenade. Holding off Andone, and he gets the ball off him. But Andone tackles him. Oh, there we go. Indeed, Timo Werner is played to watch. Oh, to Rashford. Rashford beautifully. The pace. Oh, turns the man. To Van der Beek. Back to Ra Wait, back to Fernandez. To Rashford. Rashford! Oh, wait, what? Offside, I'm doing. Alex Keller is coming off Luke Shaw and McAllister is coming off for someone I do not know. Tau. Okay. Oh, Werner could have got the ball there. Oh. Oh, Skrinar gets the ball off. Malpe. Pogba. Bruno Fernandez. Fernandez. Oh, trying to chop, but Feltman gets the ball. Tau now to Lalana. Marpe again on the ball to March. Oh, gets the ball off Malpe. Now it's to Timo Werner. Passes it to Bruno. Oh, beautiful ball to Bruno Fernandes! And it's a goal! 2-0 to Manchester United. Beautiful play there. The connection between Bruno Fernandes and Timo Werner on full display. Let's see that again. Bruno passes it to Timo. Timo chips it over to Fernandes and Fernandes rockets it top right corner. What a goal. Bringing Fred on now for Paul Pogba. Pogba's been great, been great so far, but we need a bit of fresh pair of legs, and Fred will provide that. And also, Bright is slowly building up the play again. Oh, Maguire just clobbers Malpe to the floor. I think I, I feel like that's a done, eh? Oh, to Verda. Verda! Chips the keeper! And it's over the bar. Nearly got a third goal for Manchester United, but Werner just missed the chip. Got a bit too cocky there. Oh, Veltman brings it down to Besuma. Oh, brilliant ball to our break. And he's on the break. And then De Gea launches it back out. And to Rashford. Oh, Fred. Plays Bruno. Van der Beek. Oh. Down the side to Van der Beek. Oh, tried to get to Mazaka, but March was there to intercept. Oh. Down the side, down March. Being hunted down by Squidard, but gets in the box. But does not score. Oh, look, but no cigar. Oh, 
Herbie Lozano gets past one defender, but March just gets the ball off him. Into the last seven, six, five minutes here, depending on extra time. And Arborake in the box. Gets it past one defender, but misses. Yeah. Take it off. Harry Maguire for Eric Bailly. It looks like Brighton have brought on another striker. Oh, Timo Werner to Bruno Fernandes. To Van der Beek, who's through. Van der Beek, 3 0, Manchester United. Fuck off. Van der Beek, muscling off two defenders and launches it in the corner. Look at the ball by Fernandes, Fernandes and it's through. Top right corner. 3 0. 89th minute. United have just been on form today. Obviously the true test will come in when we have to face Liverpool on deadline day. Oh, Malpe. Pass it to Connolly. Connolly does not get the ball. Now to De Gea. Oh, Tal gets to it though. Bad pass there by De Gea. Oh, Lalana gets it in. Con Connolly just threw a poor throw. What poor kick there. And it's full time. 3 0 Manchester United. The result that we were looking for there. All three points to the Manchester side. What a goal. Brilliant game by all, but 3 0 Manchester United. Alright, so here we are at press conference after the match. Your first victory is my United fan manager. It's a landmark for you, of course, but how happy with what you saw from your team? I'm very pleased indeed what I saw from the team. They gave me 100% out there, and that's all I asked for them in each and every game. So, what's we expecting? He didn't really live up to the billing, though. What? It takes a player a lot of time to settle in a new club. He'll get going once he's got a better idea of what we want from him. Timo Werner with a great debut, of course. I'm very pleased with how quickly Timo settled in and definitely looked at home today. I want more from him and I know he'll demand more from himself. Brilliant first game against Burnley, but we will be having another game against Burnley today. First one against Brighton, 3 0. Let's see how we'll get on in the next game. Alright, so let's read these messages, shall we? Uh, yeah. Okay, Cavani's sold. Phil Jones is gone. I'm not having the option to buy for Dan James. Get yeah, free thick scalp. Get yeah, a lot of scalp. Alright, see how much money we have now. 32 million. Okay, we don't need really to improve team, it's just we need to develop the team now. And because we face off against Burnley, I'm going to do a couple of rotations for this game. So these are rotations I've done. I've brought in Henderson, Shaw, Fred and Greenwood. For this game, I want them to, get, I want all these to get play time. Wait, Henderson, Shaw, Fred, Greenwood. Yeah, and Martial. All these people will be getting playtime, it's just not as often as they'd like it to be. So, yeah. So, hopefully, without further ado, we should be at home for this. It doesn't say. Great. Cyber Tip. <clears throat> Old Trafford, nice. Okay, so we'll be at home for this game. Let's get into it. Alright, so here we go. First game at Old Trafford. Obviously nowadays, Old Trafford is a bit outdated. 
since the Glades have taken over, they haven't really improved the stadium that much, except for the Wi-Fi. But it is still a national treasure, nonetheless. So, Burnley, they're not outside to take us job today, but we know we are the better team. We just need to watch out for their defence and their very quick style of attacking. And I've also got two strikers instead of the one which we have. So Dean Henderson, Yasaka, Grenar, Maguire, Shaw, Fred, Paul Pogba, Greenwood, Bruno, Marcus, and finally Anthony Martial up front. <coughs> and our bench has Timo Werner, Dory Van der James, Lozano, Tellez, Baye, and De Gea. <coughs> so, let's get into the game, shall we? The first game at home at Old Trafford is underway. We'll play this game and then we'll call it that for the episode. Short to Pogba and then to Bruno Fernandes. Martial. Oh, look at it. Damn it. Down the side. Here we go. Greenwood. Oh. Trying to cross it in, but Lawton. Lawton just got it there. Oh, to Rashford. Rashford. From outside the box. It's 1 0. 1 0. Marcus Rashford. Blasts it just outside the box. Shaw passes it beautifully to Rashford. Pogba got out of the way. And it's just the bottom left corner. That's all you need. Nick Pope couldn't do anything about it. And yet again. Man United using the swarm tactic at the very start to get the first goal of the game. 1-0 Manchester United. Oh, Westwood gets it past and he's just wanged it all the way over there. Okay. Oh, Morega nearly got that. Greenwood nearly made a bad throw in there. Oh, now to Greenwood. Greenwood dashing it down the side, but Peters tackles him, and it's a free kick. Yellow card to Eric Peters. Odds on. Right, chase kick taker to Rudolf and Ange. the worst thing that could have happened. And it's still in their penalty area, so. Oh, hits up Fred. Will he get the ball? Nope, Westwood gets it. Now to Chris Wood, former Leeds United player. Gets it through to Saleh. Now to Lawton. Oh, Barrega. Beautiful save by Dean Henderson here. Burnley are going to be a bit more of a challenging opponent than Brighton and Hove Albion. Hove Albion. Oh, Westwood just muscling Pogba off the ball. Harry Maguire trying to muscle off Chris Wood. Not successful as he's in the box. Beautiful play there. Oh, Pogba. Burnley using their strikers as midfielders here for some reason. Oh, Cork to Westwood. Now to Chris Wood. And Morega, who we know could be a very pacey striker at times. Oh, Rashford to Martial. Chips it over. Can Bruno Fernandes get to it? And he does. Bruno Fernandes have any options here? Not a lot. Pass it to Fred. Then to Pogba. Then to Rashford who will go again. 2-0. Another 
bottom left corner goal from outside the box. Pogba assists Rashford in the goal. Beautiful strike. 2-0 Manchester United. and kicks it up. Look, no, but, but no cigar there. As Eric Peters gets to it, gets past Marshall there. And this one, I mean, Marshall has not scored any of the goals today. Everyone else contributed, but Marshall's got a poor start to the game. I'll keep him on for a bit longer after half time, probably at 60th minute, but if he doesn't get a goal or assist by then, then I'm afraid he's not going to be on for long. It's Pogba. Pogba! I, I, I have to try this. Pogba, long race you win. I'm possibly winning this up as well. Oh. Skridar, having a little tussle there with Morega. Oh, Martial. What the f. He just danced around me like a fucking strip pole. Oh, Rashford gets it to Martial. Martial, oh my god. Anthony Martial really not controlling the ball here so far. Saleh gets it to Chris Wood in the box, but Aaron Wambisaka gets it out. Oh, Greenwood gets it past Alfred Martial to Paul Pogba. Free kick! Thank fuck. With 37 yards out, can Bruno Fernandes get it in the top corner? Oh, red! I can't take pre kicks properly. Oh, there we go. Down the side, Saleh gets it to Morega. Oh, look, not boat, but no cigar. Cork to Wood. I couldn't touch balls, why? So I would have got a pre kick there. I'm not going to have a pre kick. Oh, me. Try to get. Oh, Saleh! Offside. Maguire to Luke Shaw. And it's half time. Rashford contributed to both goals. So. I'll, I'm going to make some changes. First one being uh, Anthony Martial for Timo Werner and Eric Bailly for Harry Maguire. I, I just don't feel like Harry Maguire's kind of performed to level this game. So let's get this going. Second half. Can Werner come back for the two, two goal deficit here to get a draw or a win? Oh, Brady. To Cork. Oh, Skrinar gets the ball off to Bissaka. Brady tries to fight it, but it goes off to Bruno Fernandes. Timo Werner gets past one defender, gets past the other. Going on a run here to Pogba. Pogba from outside the box, and he just gets caught by Nick Pope. Oh, Baye nearly got the ball, but Wood put him on the floor there. No free kick. Oh, Greenwood gets the ball to Bruno Fernandes. Oh, and Timo Werner running for the ball there with all of his might, but does not get it. And it's a corner. This could be a chance here. Into box. On to Timo Werner's head, and it goes wide. I'm looking pretty pissed there. Timo Werner nearly gets it in, and he just puts his dick in Eric Bailly's face. Oh, Nick Pope blasts it down the pitch. Who will get it? Pogba on Wood and it's Wood to Westwood. 
for Lawson. Oh, boy, he goes in for tackle, but for some reason it dislikes him from it. And Wood, oh, nearly gets it in. Bye to Milan Screener. Oh, the flex point goes back to Pogba. Bruno Fernandes to Timo Werner. Werner, he's through. Werner! <coughs> Just misses there. Nick Pope, beautiful save. It looks like it's going to be a corner. Saleh comes off. Oh, on the noggin. Oh, Milan Screenar gets the ball to Fred. Fred! Oh! Werner tries to get it in, but me stops it. Bend me. Imagine if his name was Bend me. His parents would not have loved him. Oh, here we go. Wan Basaka. Gets it off. Greenwood dashing it up the field to Timo Werner. Back to Wambasaka. To Greenwood. Mason Greenwood puts it in. No one there though. But to Shaw. Now Timo Werner. Timo Werner from outside the box and he misses. Go now. Oh, Fred gets it to Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes gets it past. And the team of Werner. Team of Werner inside the box and Pope saves. Corner now. Very intense moment here. Go for the post tactically. I don't believe post. The goalkeeper will get it. And here it goes. Pope knocks it out. Westwood's running, so is Rashford. Who's going to get it? Rashford gets it. Rashford beautifully just exerting all of his energy there to get the ball. Timo Werner, 3-0. Timo Werner scores and he's celebrating with the Man United fans. Beautifully there. Pogba assisting Timo Werner. Pogba's second assist today. There we go. 3 0, Manchester United. Burnley, whilst they've had some good attacking opportunities, they've not fully capitalised. Oh, Tarkowski tries to get it out, but Fred capitalises. Sees Rashford running for it, but it goes for Werner. Timo Werner sees Rashford puts it to Werner again Werner oh just misses Werner was close to scoring a fourth for Manchester United let's here we go Pogba gets his Bruno Fernandes oh Werner inside the box here that's not a real goal scorer of future, but Werner! Oh, the crossbar! Oh, Pogba tries to. But no cigar. Oh, look, but no cigar. I'm afraid. Luke Shaw gets the ball to Timo Werner. Who gets it to Mason Greenwood? Greenwood tries to get through, but Peters floors him again. Oh, Rashford needs to. Just let it go there. Lauter's coming off. Sean Dyche, Sean Dyche there. Luke Shaw crosses Paul Pogba there. Unmanned, unmarked. Oh, Fred gets his team on Werner. And to Greenwood there. 
Greenwood chips it over, but Tarkowski adds to it. Pogba passes it straight to Westwood. Oh, Fred! Oh, Werner gets passed! And he misses again! That was a poor attempt there by Timo Werner. Probably got it on the wrong foot. Nick Pope blasts it up. A last attempt to get a goal as Baye muscles Morega off the ball and Morega muscles off Fred. Stevens, Morega. Oh, Wambasaka gets the ball. Four minutes, edit, extra, extra time. Two. Mason Greenwood. Who gets it to Bruno Fernandes? Werner shoots and again misses. Timo Werner really got capsized on his opportunities today. Oh, Pogba gets it to Bruno Fernandes. What on earth was that ball? But after the four minutes of extra time. Manchester United come out of it. Another 3 0 victory against the lower side team. The midfield of Burnley was a really good one. Timo Werner had 10 attempts, Rolls well scored 1. That wasn't the greatest air from Timo Werner today. Three chances, and he just blasts it a million miles away. Rashford surely got man of the match there today. In my opinion, he was the man of the match, and he did. 9.4 rating. Well done, Marcus. That was a great performance today. Alright. So, the headlines after today will be all about Ra Rashford's performance, yep. Two goals were probably what was the game. He's strong, committed, skillful, and a real team player. And I'm proud of him. Little stages Burnley weren't going to be able to put your team under pressure. Yeah. It's not up to me to give advice to our opponents. I know the lads won't let the win go to their heads, so there will be more difficult games in the future. We have players that we could trust to deliver the big moments. I think even Burnley would admit we were the better team today. But, ladies and gentlemen, the Premier League table as it stands now, Manchester United lead in a six goal difference. No goal scored past our goalkeepers yet. With Leicester, Arsenal, Southampton, Chelsea, Liverpool, Newcastle, Man City, Wolves, Everton, Crystal Palace, Spurs, Fulham, West Brom, West Ham, Aston Villa, Leeds, Brighton, Sheffield United and Burnley at the bottom of the table. So it looks like our win against Burnley puts them at the bottom of the table. But ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you take care and peace.